Hi guys, we're at the Delano and we are in room 6901. So what we did was got two rooms connecting, but they didn't have two rooms connecting ready for us. All they had was a handicapped and a regular, which we said was totally fine because we just wanted to get into our rooms as soon as possible. So I'm gonna show you, this is just the main entrance of one of the rooms. The doors are open because they are connected. I'll show you guys that in a second. But in here you actually have a little small water closet. This is really nice. I'm dressed to go to the pool because we are gonna head to the pool as soon as we are done here. So this is just like a regular water closet off to the side of the room right when you walk in, which is really, really nice if you're staying with a lot of people because there's more bathrooms in case anybody has to go right away or two people have to go or something. And then in every room, you're gonna have this living room and there's gonna be a work desk, which is really, really nice. A chair, a TV, and then you have like this really nice art. I really like the aesthetic in these rooms. They're just really clean and neat looking. Um, there's never much of a huge view at any of the Dell and our rooms, so I'm gonna be totally honest. I wouldn't pay for an upgraded view. That's just my opinion. I just don't think the views are anything spectacular in comparison to like the Bellagio or something like that. Um, each room's gonna have one of these like bar carts. Obviously everything on here is a sensor. However, we have brought our own K cups before and cups and then you can just make your own K cups for free. So free coffee in the room. And the mini fridge actually does have a shelf, which is really nice, which they didn't have when we were staying at the Bellagio where you can put your own things in. But again, don't touch anything in the mini bar because you will get charged for that. So just be careful with that. Okay, so this is a queen. So these are a two queen rooms. Sorry about our stuff. We obviously walked in here, but you get two nice sized closets on each side and a little couch, same thing here. So these are actually really nice. I'll show you the handicapped bathroom out of curiosity in case you guys are wondering, I can show you. So double vanity with his and her sinks, which is really, really nice. And some, the bath products are from the bathhouse spa. There's a couple shelves, not a ton of storage in this one. There is a TV, they all come with TVs. Toilets here, and then you have the handicap shower. So this is what a handicap room looks like, in case you guys are curious, if they tell you that's what's available, that's what that looks like. But here is our queen beds. And because our rooms are connecting, you guys can see I came in that door and you're gonna go through here. Hi friends. So same situation here, you walk into that door and there is a bathroom right there. So exact same thing, exact same wet bar. All of this is exactly the same. So then when you go in here, is everyone decent? Yeah. Okay, I'm coming in. Um, this is a king size bed, so same situation. Um, just a little bit more space just because you have like this little cherry on stuff and um, the cl instead of having a couch you actually have like this little chest of drawer thing here and then a TV here so I'll show you the bathroom because that's really the biggest difference so obviously if you're just two people you would do a king but the biggest difference would be the bathroom in this room you have a huge tub with a shower so that's the difference for the handicapped version is that difference and then you do have the double vanity so it's pretty similar and you do have a private toilet for these so I obviously I mean if you don't need the handicapped bathroom you're probably gonna want to get the regular bathroom because it's a little bit nicer but that's really the only main difference. But yeah, we have so many people staying with us that we just decided to get connecting rooms and these were the two they had available. We're not gonna be in the rooms a ton because of everything that we are doing. So yeah, that is pretty much the room tour. I really like this hotel. I think this is one of the better hotels on the Strip personally, if you were to ask me. Um, I just think that the suites for their price are really reasonable and you get what you pay for when you get these rooms. And if you're staying with a lot of people, this hat is so ridiculous, I have to take it off. <laughs> 
Um, if you're staying with a lot of people, I feel like this is definitely the way to go as far as like booking a regular room for all those people. So, oh, and I didn't show you guys the toiletries. I'll show you just like the bathhouse spa products. Um, they're okay. I think the ones at the Bellagio are better than these ones. You do have these mirrors. I didn't point that out. And you do have a hair dryer. There are irons in the rooms. There are safes in the rooms. All the usual stuff. So, yeah. That was the tour. I hope you guys enjoyed.